students welcome you all in this video we are going to see how to install google classroom and how to join to the google classroom so for that we need to install the google classroom app so for that open the google play store and in the search bar you type google classroom so we got the google classroom so now install the google classroom by clicking the button install the installation process has started now yes it's about to end so all your homework homework everything uh, is going to come through the google classroom hereafter and now after installation open the google classroom app yes click open now click on the button get started yes so for this you need to choose a gmail account for uh, opening the google classroom so first of all you have to create a new account for that click the second option that is add account and click ok now you need to create a new mail id which you will be using throughout your school days ok so click the uh, create account at the bottom in that choose the first one that is for myself after this you have to enter your name and your last name here your name is the first name and the last name is your initial okay suppose if you are a girl enter your name here okay as your uh, name okay suppose if you are a boy then enter your name so i am entering here as Ravin Kumar okay then your initial should be entered in the last name yes so uh, this is just an example in this place you have to enter your name and your initial okay so click the button next now you need to enter your date of birth and your gender okay so this is also again an example in this place you have to enter your date of birth and your gender i'm for example i'm entering the date as 13 july 2005 you have to choose your date of birth and your gender since it since the name which i gave was a boy i'm choosing it as male if you are a girl then you have to choose female yes so after entering all the details correctly click the button next now you have to create a gmail address okay so enter the gmail address as uh, your name full stop your present class okay the class to which you are promoted now okay so the name is Praveen Kumar which I have chosen for example then the initial is S then followed by a full stop uh, sorry yes Praveen Kumar S dot then your present class if you are if you are promoted from 6th standard to 7th standard then you enter your class as 7th and your section for example I am choosing it as 7E ok then dot SAS here SAS means Sri Amman school ok so you have to enter your name followed by your initial then a full stop then your present class that is which the class to which you are promoted 7th A dot then the school name that is SAS after entering all these things click next the, then enter the password this password you have to remember throughout all the time because uh, wherever you go to log into your account you need to use the same password so I am choosing some password here
the same way you have to enter your password so you confirm the password once again you have to re retype the same password you have to type in the second column also and after doing this click the button next now scroll down okay to the bottom and you can see here the button skip click the button skip okay now your mail id is ready here now click the button next now again scroll down here and click the button i agree so your login process is about to over yes we are redirected to the google classroom app now yes your google classroom is ready now you can see here to the top right hand side in a, a purple color uh, with letter p which is nothing but you have uh, it's an indication that you have logged in with this particular mail id okay so now uh, click the button a uh, plus at the bottom to join a class here so on clicking plus you will get these two options okay so click the button join class now enter the class code which you have received for each subject now i am entering the class code for example g q y 4 e f m l this is an an example code you have to enter your code not this one so on entering this code click the button join at the top right so now you have joined the class 7th a mathematics similarly to join the other classes click the uh, uh, three horizontal lines at the top left so here click on that and the, click the first option that is classes now again at the bottom click the plus mark and uh, click the join class now enter the code for other subject for example for science I'm having a code like this this is just an example code don't try with this code you have to use the code which you have received from school through whatsapp now after entering the code click the button join yes so you have joined the 7th a science class also yes so again go back to the uh, triple uh, horizontal lines at the top left click on that and click the button classes so here till now we have joined two classes in the same way join the other three classes also by using the plus mark which is seen at the bottom of your screen so now uh, let me tell you how to uh, see your homework and how to send the homework which you have sent so now for that open uh, the subject which you want to see on uh, clicking the max class you will be redirected to this page yes so here you can see three buttons at the bottom the first one is stream so whatever you are seeing here is the stream page now the second one is the classwork okay so in under this page you will you can find all the homeworks which is given to you under the max subject so now there is now there is only one homework here so to uh, know the details of max homework that is this particular uh, max homework click on the homework that is max video number 15 on that you click on it okay so now you can see this is the title and the points given as 100 points and uh, you can see here uh, the instruction watch today's video and complete the assignment which is given to you this is the instruction which is given and uh, along with this there are two attachments the first one is the video attachment and the second one is the homework which you have to finish it off so first to watch the video click the first attachment on clicking this you will be uh, redirected to the 
Hello everyone. If Welcome to the fourth video. This is how you will be redirected to YouTube and you can watch all the videos here. After watching the YouTube video, then again go back to the classroom app okay and uh, look for the homework which is given there by by clicking the second attachment so your homework will be shown here yes so you have to answer all these questions okay and the answer should be written in a piece of paper uh, in which you have to mention your name your class your uh, the date on which you have done the work and the details of all the homework you have to write on the paper on completing the homework again what you need to do is do is you have to send this homework back to the teacher so to do that you have to click the arrow mark which you can see at the bottom so can you see here at the bottom there is a arrow mark towards upside click on that okay so your work which means your homework which you have written in a notebook that you have to uh, take a photo and you have to attach it here so to attach the homer click add attachment okay so i have already taken a photo okay so now to choose the photo what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on the option file so these are the different options okay so you can either uh, choose a photo from your gallery by using the option file or you can take a photo or you can take a photo directly by clicking the button take photo so now, now I have already taken a photo so I'm going to choose the photo from my file by clicking the file so I'm choosing gallery here okay I have uh, different photos here so I'm choosing my homework okay on clicking that homework your homework will be getting attached here you can see a blue uh, mark blue round mark okay now the process is going on yes so your attachment has been uploaded here okay on after attach after attaching all the photos suppose if you have four photos after attaching all the photos what you need to do is click the button turn in this button turn in you will get only when all the attachments are included is that clear so after that click the button turn in turn in so you have to click the button turn in which means you are submitting your homework yes so now you can see here work is work submitted which means you have sent your work this is how you can send all your homeworks to know whether you have sent your homework uh, in a simple way go back to the left uh, uh, menu bar and you can see here an option to do click the button to do in this you will get to know all the homeworks which you have to finish it off okay to do means which you have to do so which you need to do all the things will appear under this column which you have done and which you have submitted to the teachers will be appearing in the second column that is can you see here a down a done option on this you can see here so now few minutes back we have sent the max homework so when you complete the homework it will be uh, appearing in the done bar and the work which you have to finish which you have to do all the things will appear in this column okay so this is how you can uh, watch all the videos and do the homeworks and you can send the works to the teacher okay thank you